In 1906, Tucson High Magnet School began classes in a small two-room adobe building. We are Tucson's oldest existing high school. In 1956, Tucson High was the largest high school in the United States with over 6,800 students. Tucson High is the first school in the nation to achieve a national record in three major sports. 500 wins in football, 1,000 wins in basketball, and 1,000 wins in baseball. This is a, a, a digital media class. It is basically a, a class that teaches kids about uh, media criticism, filmmaking, script writing, um, and the uh, history of cinema. What I enjoy about being in this class is the freedom you have to create and to do that through you know, modern technology and, and pretty substantial equipment. Well, my family loves my artwork compared to just painting with the paintbrush. We're like, oh yeah, good job. But like this one, they're like, wow, how'd you do that? The paint's so smooth. I'm like, oh, I did it with an airbrush. They're learning the manual end of non-computer oriented commercial design. The uh, strand of this would go into commercial illustration, technical illustration, a lot of illustrative fields. In the photography program at Tucson High, what we do is we do film and it, all the way to digital. And we have a black and white and a color lab. We have the computers, a full studio. We're in the CTE department, career and tech ed department. Students, when they leave here, they should be able to get a job in photography. It's kind of a change from like sitting at a desk and doing homework or like working on math problems. It's more hands-on. Everything is done right. I was always into theater, but coming here, you learn so much on stage and for film, so there's a lot of good instruction for sure. Perfect. All right, let's try that again. I think that the kids love learning sign language because they can do it. It's a beautiful language, and I fell in love with it at first sight, so I know that the other kids would do the same thing. Break down now. This has probably got the best science department, I believe, in the state of Arizona. This is an amazing place to come for math and science. Not only do we have the advanced math, but we also have the research methods in science, where they get to go and work at the university in an actual lab. Everyone in here really wants to learn about math. We're all more engaged, and so it's a much more relaxed atmosphere. This year, I studied how soil microbes contribute to the atmospheric carbon dioxide levels. My specific research project is looking at cobopods in the Sea of Cortez and observing whether they ingest microscopic plastic. Tucson High is one of the only schools I know of that has this class, specifically research methods. And for that reason, I would consider Tucson High one of the best schools to go to for science. Because not only do we have this class, we have um, biotech and a lot of other classes that actually prepare students for a career in, in science. And also the U of A is right across the street, and that gives us so many opportunities that other schools don't have. We've had 19 finalists that have gone on to the International Science and Engineering Fair, and many of those have won grand awards there. We've had uh, four or five students get their work published from uh, in peer-reviewed journal articles from the work that they've done in this class, and we've also had one patent applied for. <laughs> We have uh, quality coaches here in all the sports, fall, spring, and winter, and a variety of programs as well that basically appeal to everybody. <laughs> Tucson High being one of the oldest high schools in Arizona has some of the dominant programs from the early 1900s and programs that were always championship caliber. <laughs> Tucson High is an excellent place to come. I'd recommend it for anybody. Our new school word for music connects us, which is when you connect with a large group of people that are focused on a single goal.
tend to learn different types of music that come from mariachi. There's rancheras, there's boleros. Sometimes it's like slow love songs, fast fun songs. It brings out the culture that we have, the Hispanic culture that's so incorporated in here, and it kind of brightens up the whole community by like, opening up the music for everybody. My name's Chris Dodge, and I teach the uh, steel drum program at Tucson High. The kids, they have a wonderful time playing the steel drums, and um, they have full ownership in the program, and I think that's key to it. Um, they not only do they belong to the, the group, but they are thriving members, and they contribute to the group artistically on every level. Hi, my name is Christine Clark. I was accepted to Harvard University. My name is Nancy Freitas, and I was accepted to the University of California, Berkeley. This year's class, over $12 million in scholarships were awarded to seniors, 81% attend college after high school, and approximately 200 students were accepted to the University of Arizona. Tucson High has always been in the forefront of incorporating the arts into what we make up as the whole um, identity of the school. And arts are valued here, and arts thrive. The thing that I enjoy the most about being at Tucson High School is the diversity that it offers. You know, there's so many people and there's so many different things that are going on that you can really do whatever you want here. Tucson High is very, very welcoming for young people. It embraces them with open arms and teaches them skills that they'll have forever. Tucson High is the most dynamic, the most interesting, and offers the most program choices of any school in Tucson. 